<coughs> Hi guys, um, welcome to Thursday's unique content. Um, I'm now going to talk for about 20-ish minutes about the leaked H&G H build and how and why I feel that it is going to kill H&G. Um, let, let, let's just let the elephant in the room drop as it is, uh, which is the bolt action sway increase. Um, for the last three builds, four builds, hell, since last year even, bolt action sway has just gotten ridiculous. Um, it's not so much that bad if you have an iron sight but the moment you get any kind of scope whether it be 2x 4x or 8x it is like you are literally michael j fox your scope is all over the place you it, it's almost impossible to hit a target even when you're prone your scope is still swaying left and right left and right i know people who have gotten motion sick because there's that much fucking sway um, with the sniper rifles, with, with the bolt actions. Now, they're nerfing all bolt nice. actions because of all the pissant fighter pilots can piss moaning and complaining about PTRDs. Well, how about you just nerf the PTRD? How about you just nerf the infantry first badge? So instead of it being 50 damage, it's 25. But no, they're going to nerf every single bolt action in the game. Because either they're just lazy or they just don't give a fuck anymore. And it shows. It shows that Splixen just doesn't care about his pet project anymore. I mean, he's handing off all the map designs over to Deshi. And don't get me wrong, Deshi, I, 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 you may think that you do a really good job, but you don't, mate. The fact that there's floating fences on airfield. The fact that there's houses that you have to freaking damn near Mario-style moon jump up just to get in because you're too lazy to code a fucking step. That, that, that's just pure fucking laziness that's all what that is it's just laziness there's no quality assurance there's no q a even when the test servers do go up and we point out bugs they're still in the game the fact that you are so lazy in your quality assurance that the last build on freaking town you could get underneath the sea the the the, the uh, uh, you could get under C4 but before the metal bridge, hide under the ground and kill people throughout anywhere else around, um, around the map. Literally, you could just flop flop, you're under the ground, kill people, kill people, kill people. Oh, I'm going to go to the church now. Kill people, kill people, kill people. Oh, I'm going to stay in your spawn because your spawn protect doesn't affect me. Kill people, kill people, kill people. That is how fucking lazy Ritu you have gotten. Okay? Splixen, brother, I love you, man. Gargamel, I love you too. I love this game. Okay? I do. I, 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 this is why I'm making this video in hopes that someone at Ritu is going to see this and realize that just because you're listening to the, the major voices screaming in one ear and ignoring the others who are whispering in the other ear, no. Just, just no. Stop fucking listening to the whiny fucking five-year-olds who have just joined the fucking game and fuck over your players that have been loyal to you for years now. And I mean years. This is my fucking... Uh, 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 the, 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 count, the account I use now is my primary alpha test count when I was part of that freaking small alpha group. That's how long I've been playing H&G, and I am telling you, I am fucking telling you, you're going to kill your game if you go ahead with this build idea. Add the medkits, that's fine. Fuck around with the spawn system, that's fine. But here's a hint, if I'm in a tank and we own damn near half the map, 
Why am I forced to spawn all the way back at the beginning of the fucking map? Oh, that's right. Because you're fucking stupid. So you're telling me we're not going to go ahead and create a forward fucking base of operations. Where we're going to have tanks. We're going to have jeeps. We're going to have Christ knows what else. Waiting for infantry who are there to use. No, no, no. That's definitely not how the US Army did it. Now, was it? That's definitely not how the German army did it, was it? It's definitely not how any professional fucking army in any fucking point of war, at any point on this fucking planet, did that. Now, did they? No, exactly. Exactly, Rita. Your idea is, oh, 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 you're just about to take the church? Oh, guess what? Spawn all the way at Charlie 1. Uh, what? Makes no fucking sense. No fucking sense. The sway on the bolt actions, honestly, let's see, you're fucking over infantry, you're fucking over recon. Uh, you're adding a kill assist. Okay, will that add to people using binocs and spotting? No, of course not, because that would be too fucking simple. That would be the one thing that we've been asking for since the implementation of the fucking, uh, uh, in the game, isn't it? Oh, I'm sitting here with a pair of binocs. I've marked a fucking tank. Friendly tank takes it out. Do I get a kill assist for that? I don't know. Okay, I'm a recon. I'm doing my fucking job as a recon. I am not shooting my gun. I'm spotting infantry, armor, vehicles. I'm doing my fucking job. I am doing my job as a recon. I am being the eyes and the ears of my fucking army, and I get fuck all for it. I get no EXP. I get no ribbon EXP. I get no credits. I get... Nothing. Absolutely nothing for doing my fucking job. Yet some schmuck stat back at the base by a tree, shooting the fucking tree to power level his fucking car 98, gets credits, EXP, and Christ knows what else. Yet I get fuck all. You have a fucking recon badge. Rib you have a recon ribbon and a badge set. Yet the only way, apparently, to, the only way to get EXP for it is long-range sniper kills. How? How when we don't, when, when you're gonna fuck us from even doing that? Because guess what? We're now Michael J. Fox without his fucking medication, upside down after being waterboarded. <laughs> Our fucking scopes aren't even gonna be able to get on target. You'll be lucky if you can be able to fucking hit a fucking target. I'm serious, Ritu. You want to add more sway when people have been asking for less sway? Hell, people have been even asking for a hold your breath mechanic, which is part of basic fucking infantry learning when you go into the army. How about one of you, Ritu, actually goes for the day to an army base and watches how an army is fucking trained? Trust me, your eyes will open so goddamn wide, no one will ever mistake you for being Asian ever again. That's how wide shut your eyes are, Ritu. I mean, literally, eyes wide shut. Oh, we're not going to hold a hold your breath mechanic, that would be too easy. Too easy for what? To actually get a kill with a bolt action over the fact that you've now made the semi-automatics the de facto meta in the game? Or how about the fact that anyone can set a, 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 a semi-automatic rifle, M1 gearing, Gewehr, uh, Gewehr, whatever, and set that sucker up to outfire a Browning automatic? Why? Because of the scroll wheel glitch that you still haven't fucking fixed, that according to you is not a glitch. Really? Really? You tried to ban my account because my mouse has built-in macros. And yet, there's people running around with a scroll wheel glitch. What? What? It's fucking excuse me? You fucking hypocritical, condescending, two-faced fucking retards. Seriously. You try to ban my fucking account because my mouse had built-in macros. So I went out of my way, had a friend disable the fucking macro functions on my mouse by removing the fucking memory out of my left, out of my razor, not out of my death adder, because it's freaking synapses stuff. Oh, 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 that's a macro. Can't macro, macros, no, macros bad, Ma no, macros. But 
I can set my attack wheel to my scroll wheel and just scroll for days and watch my eight round gear and go brap and I'm, I've got to reload now. Yeah, no, no, no amount of heavy set is going to protect you from that shit, is it? Me too. The fact that people are doing it with their with their semi-automatic M1 carbines, I've literally watched a tanker go blah, 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 and fire his semi-automatic carbine faster than me with my fully automatic carbine with a trigger and a light and spring at a thousand rounds. Oh, and so you go ahead and you want to nerf the carbines. You want to add, uh, or is it a recoil increase? Uh, and you want to reduce the amount of magazines a carbine takes. That's fine. That's fine. Do that. That Do that. But at the same time, the Browning Automatic needs a buff. The Thompson needs a buff. The Grease Gun, which came out after the Thompson in the war, not before it, by the way, Ritu, needs a buff. Uh, what else needs a buff? Um, well, I'm thinking, what else needs a buff? Uh, MG34 needs a buff. Um, the sights on the, the 1919 need to be replaced because those are the sights on the 1919 as if it was mounted on a freaking tug or a nave. Those are naval sights. Those were designed to shoot at aircraft. You twat waffles, not infantry. Oh, no, 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 you won't put the, the correct sight on the 1919, that would make it too OP. You won't give the uh, tankers the ability to fire the, the coaxial machine guns with a right click on their mouse, because that would make it too OP. What the fuck do you even know what OP is? See, I actually suggested, during one of their live streams, to, to, to both Robotron, to Splixen, to Gargamel, why don't they do... Uh, uh, devs versus streamers, i.e. Cotton, Waxy, Cow, myself, uh, uh, um, uh, uh, Attaway, literally uh, get all of the streamers together, get all of the devs together, throw us on dev accounts so, so we don't have to worry about us grinding out whatever or getting whatever badges, it's just bye, 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 and we do best two out of three. Devs versus us. And we'll see who fucking wins. We would literally show the devs how players are, are playing their game. See, this is the thing. I, I honestly think deep down, and, and bear in mind, this is my, my thoughts here, guys. My thoughts here. I honestly think that Ritu want us to play the game how they want us to play the game. Not how we want to play the game. This is why, think about it, oh, all of a sudden, Recon finally get an extra point to, uh, uh, no, 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 that, that's too late, that's too little, too fucking late. Why? Again, I clearly pointed out in my Recon video, and in my Infantry video, that it's, it, it, it's a lot, so, well, you get access to extra barrels and 8x scopes, it's not worth it. It is not worth it for the loss of that many equipment points, it's just not worth it. I'm sorry, it's not. You still get the same one-shot kill capability. That's why, why do you think people run around with two primaries? Sure. MP40 and Car 98, or freaking uh, Grease Gun and, and um, M1903, or uh, PPSH-41 and, and Mosin the Gam. Why do you think they run around with, with dual primaries? Because a soldier who just doesn't care about tanks, who's not purposely go oh, oh oh there's a tank there right there let me just stand right still oh hello kill me kill me no no if you're smart you're not gonna fucking be around for a tank to shoot you that's what those primary builds were for you use your your, your smg to, to take the objective and you use your bolt action to hold the objective that is the idea of it there's no other ifs ands or fucking buts about that occasionally i've seen some people do the opposite they've used their, their bolt action to take an objective Looking at you, Waxy, that was hilarious. Uh, uh, um, looking at you, Yugen, as well, that was absolutely hilarious when you did that. But, point is, we've been asking for a flying tutorial. We've been asking for an update to the tutorial to add flying. So what do you do? You remove the tutorial completely. We, we ask, how comes every time when we ask for something, you remove it? Or you make it worse. It's like you're doing this, try to do, try to do this, this reverse psychology shit on us. 
I'm serious. It's like you purposely go out of your way to try to do this reverse psychology shit on us. Oh, oh, you want less sway? We'll give you more. Be glad that you've got what you've got. Hmm. Uh, no. Seriously. If this update goes as uh, as proposed, which has been leaked several times online or whatnot, I'm pretty sure, you know, I, 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 I if I can find the, the links that was linked to me during my chat last night, I will post the link in the video description. Um... And I'm, I don't care about the map updates. The map updates are mundane. They're boring and they're pedantic. Oh, you finally realized that tankers and other people are abusing the spawn system. Like we fucking warned you during the last dev stream. But all you kept doing was muting us and telling us we don't know what we're talking about. Motherfucker, we're the ones who play your game. We know more about it than you do. We have websites dedicated to weapons builds to... to, to Freaking optimal this and time to kill that and Christ knows what else. Even they, out of protest, have stopped updating their websites. Looking at you, Reds. Thank you for everything you've done, Reds. Again, I'll post a link to Reds website in the video description down below, guys. But seriously, V2, anyone, Robotron, Splixen, Gargamel, anyone, Deshi, anyone. Who fucking gets to see this video at, 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 at Ritu? No. We want less scope sway. We want less J.J. Abrams lens flares. If I'm at the base of a fucking tree in the fucking shade and I pull my scope up to look at something and I'm blinded because you can't figure out the light ray system properly? No. Just, just, just no. I'm not asking us to, I'm not asking you to completely remove it. I'm asking you to tone it down a bit. That's all. I'm just asking you to tone the freaking thing down a bit. That's all. That's all I'm asking. And so your update is to, oh, if you're within X amount of feet of, arm, uh, of armor and, and you, you kill or destroy something, you'll get a passive increase to EXP and credits. That doesn't mean shit, dude. That's not enough for an infantryman. Because we, we would make more EXP and credits defending an objective than we ever would defending armor. And I know because I am a tanker. I know because I have armor. I know because on in all three factions, I never get any fucking infantry support ever. Even when I'm squatted up with people. And that's another thing. How is it I'm rank 15 and you're purposely squatting me up with rank 0s, 1s and 2s and 3s that don't even have fucking org seats? You said so many fucking death streams ago that that shit won't happen ever again. Full of fucking shit, dude. You need to have a fuck. Find yourself a toilet and have yourself a movement because you're so full of fucking shit. Because that fucking thing happens to me damn near every fucking time I stream. Go back to my YouTube my YouTube gaming streams, you'll fucking see it for your own goddamn eyes. Oh, I'm rank 15, rank 16. Oh, here's a rank 1. Why would a major plus follow the orders of a dipshit fucking clueless private? Oh, we wouldn't, would we? So, we end up losing that match because I know I've got a really good tank or I've got a really good recon or I've got a really good whatever fucking org unit. That I would love to have switched to, but I can't because you got me platooned with a fucking idiot. Because your stupid squad system. Oh my god, that is just cancer. It is AIDS infected, wrapped up in barbed wire, dipped in fucking AIDS. Cancer. That is what that is. And the amount of times people have mentioned on both Reddit and fucking Christ knows what else. Please, 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 for the love of fucking god. Stop. Fix that shit. You're like, oh, it's fixed. It won't happen again. Bollocks. Fucking huge mammoth hairy testicle load of bollocks. Because it fucking happens to me every goddamn day. Now. Scope sway. Whatever. Oh, and you're increasing the time to shoulder a bolt action. So not only do we have a slower rate of fire. Not only do we ha now have worse accuracy. But we've now got a slower rate to lift the weapon up. What Are you telling me that a bolt action rifle weighs more or is more cumbersome than a semi-auto when most semi-autos were just modified bolt actions again forgottenweapons.com i will post a link to his youtube channel again in the video description go check him out he's done so many videos on semi-automatic converted bolt actions 
that were actually used in World War One and World War Two. So trust me on this, Ritu. You haven't got a fucking clue what you're doing. And yes, I know you're trying to do it for balance reasons. What are you trying to balance out? Are you trying to tell me that bolt actions are, 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 are ruling the battlefield? You're full of fucking shit. M1, M2 carbines, AVSs, Sturmgewehrs, MP40s, Thompsons, Grease Guns, Semi-Autos, Bolt Action. That's how it goes in fucking game meta right now, with a PTRD being somewhere between the MP40 and the Thompson. How do I know this? I play your game! I don't have access to your, the data analytics that you do, but you've got to understand, if you try to... Uh, uh, you're doing the World of Tanks problem. In World of Tanks, they look at their Russian server, their EU server, see what's meta there, and apply it to every fucking server that they have. The North American, the Asian servers, and it just doesn't fucking work. Why? Because the player mentality of a fucking US player and an Australian player that play on the Asian and the North American server is not the same as a bumblefuck dipshit, I've got a vodka bottle stuck up my ass Russian, okay? This is why the North American fucking dev team can't get their shit together because when they get patches from the fucking EU server, they literally look at it and go, are you fucking nuts? This is why when EU devs get to play on the North American server, they're like, why isn't half the shit we implemented here? And I'll tell you, because that's not the fucking meta here, you retard. You are literally doing that. You're taking shit that's being said in Russia and EU and Christ knows what else and trying to apply it to American players, to fucking, to, to your entire player base, when that's not how it fucking works. Take a look at the entire fucking server meta. Not just your EU, not just your, not your fucking Russian players or whatever. Take a look at all of them. And then fucking look at it and say, oh fuck, if we do apply this to our North American players, who are primarily semi-automatic and freaking bolt action, we're fucking over 40% of our fucking player base. What you're doing is you're going for the quick cash grab since the game went live. And I'm sorry, it fucking shows. You are making the biggest mistake ever. You're doing exactly what fucking Wargaming did. You're doing exactly what freaking World of Tanks did. You're doing exactly what fucking Gaijin did with War Thunder. All of a sudden, a new tech branch gets out. Oh, oh, you can buy into the tech branch early. Blah, 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 blah. No, just, just no. No, just, just fucking no. I've got about two minutes left, so I'm going to sum this up. 90% of the new patch concerning spawns, maps, and whatnot, do it. I don't care. When it concerns the weapons and the quote-unquote weapons balancing, I do fucking care. I do fucking care greatly. Because this will literally be the last nail in the H&G coffin. Especially on my YouTube channel, as well as my Twitch channel. My, me streaming. I'm, I'm, I'm honestly at the point where if this does go through, I'm going to remove every H&G video on my channel. I won't do any more H&G content. And as far as I'm concerned, I won't buy into your bullshit ever again. I won't. I just won't. Good job. I just... Seriously, Ritu. Please. Splixen. Yeah. Please. You're the game director. Listen to this video. or l Listen to all of it. I'm trying to be honest. I'm giving you my heartfelt honesty here. Please. Please. I'm begging you. Don't do this. You will kill your game. Every... Every plane gets nose mounted. Hope you enjoyed the video. It's not about the, 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 the video in the background, it's about what I'm saying here. Till then guys, I'll see you tomorrow.